I always ask, if you had to rank these things from top to bottom, what mm-hmm. has to come first, second, and what's absolutely last? Uh-huh. Love, power, respect. Love, respect, loyalty. Uh-huh. What has to come first for you? Respect. Why? Respect because respect me. Like, why? Because mm-hmm. I'm a man of, and I'm a, I'm a man of respect. I, I, I expect respect because mm-hmm. I give respect. So, you know what I'm saying? After rip, I'm going to give you, I'm going I'm to give out what I expect to get back. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, that's in the beginning. Respect. And that's you can love me last, cause you can love a person, you can cross and do all. You know what I'm saying? It's true. Like you can, you can, you can, you can love a person, and not respect them. You know what I'm saying? You can be loyal to them, and not love them, but I respect. I I, I expect um respect. The, the respect first. You know what I'm saying? Loyalty and then love. So why I love last then? Because love can it it, it love <clears throat> can it can you up in many ways. You know what I'm saying? Cause how you gonna love me and you don't respect me? Mm. You know what I'm saying? You think you can love somebody and not and not respect them? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I'm asking you. Do I think I can love somebody and not respect them? Yeah. Mm. I think um, I can have love for somebody and not respect them. Oh, that's what I'm saying. But loving somebody and having love. Like, I got love for everybody in this room. Mm-hmm. It's my first time meeting all y'all. Yeah. It's respect first, though. You ain't just come off disrespecting a nigga before you uh, got love for him. So when you ask me about respect, I think it's subjective. Yeah. I think a lot of things that we care about, like this respect thing, mm-hmm. I feel like it really don't matter because to your defi- what, what your definition of respect might, might be mm-hmm. might not be mine. Okay. Well, my definition of respect might not be yours. Okay. Right? So I might expect you to greet me a certain way. Mm-hmm. And you're like, what? Mm-hmm. Who the fuck you is? Right, right, right. Or... Even back back in the day, I think about coming from the hood because I came from the projects. Right. And I always um, associated with respect with, I don't know, like just not being a mm-hmm. Right? Then I grew up and I understood that that was like far left of what respect was. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So now that I understand it, I understand that it can be subjective. So mm-hmm. like everybody always say respect first. And I'm like, what does that really mean? Mm-hmm. What does respect really mean? Because if you don't respect me... Mm-hmm. I just leave. Mm-hmm. I exit. My presence don't have to be here. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> so what respect mean to you? Hey, respect mean goddamn. You goddamn like. Res- what respect means to me? Mm-hmm. Respect mean like a certain way you handle situation, certain way you approach, a certain way you handle handle a person, or you know what I'm saying. Like like you say. <laughs> Walk past you, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. If I'm coming, if I'm coming in the room and speak, you don't speak. First, it, like baby say, first you respect, disrespect, then it's fuck you. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna respect y'all for real, but if I don't get the same shit back, you like I leave just like you said. Yeah, I, so it's kind of the same. Shit. It's crazy though when I say it's subjective. I think about it now. When, I don't know how your parents grew up. Mm-hmm. I grew up. I think I gotta make, get it right. When you come in the room, you, you greet everybody. Speak. Right, yeah, I'm right. But some people I heard that if you're in the room and someone comes in, you should always speak. Just like that. That's it different. depends on if it's your room. Right. But you see, how it depends. I feel like it's so subjective. Because for somebody that don't know, they like, it depends. Like, we can know that. But for somebody who don't know, they like, yo, I was taught that you should always speak when you come in. You're damn right. Right? Yeah. But if it's my room yeah. and I'm like, bro. Speak to me. So what's up? You coming to my house, you just going to come in my shit and don't speak? You get what I'm saying? Damn so right. That's why I say re- respect is like. It can go a lot of ways. It can go a lot of ways. Yeah, it definitely can. Now. That's why for me, I always say loyalty first. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, I not always. I just started getting into that. Yeah. Before so I what made you start getting into that loyalty first, though? Because if I could choose, mm-hmm. right, respect garnished me nothing. Mm-hmm. Get, like, it gets me nothing. It's right, like, okay, right, right. he respected me. Yeah. But if I had, if I was like a loyal Loyalty mean a lot, though. Yeah, love yeah I get dope. what you're saying. But I say loyalty because if... If I had magic, right, mm-hmm. and I was like, yo, everybody is going to be loyal to me. Mm-hmm. Loyalty means something. That means if you're in a room and I'm not there, you're going to treat it as if I was there. If somebody's going to f- me over and you're there, mm-hmm. I'm just saying magical loyalty. That, like at the, at the core of what loyalty is. Yeah. You're not going to do me dirty. Yeah. That's loyalty. Yeah. I can respect you. Mm-hmm. But respect the hustle even more. Mm-hmm. I can respect you. Yeah. 
but respect the business even more. Yeah. You get what I'm trying to yeah, say? Yeah, for sure, for sure. So it's like, and it's like some people will be like, I'm pretty sure you understand this. Dog, it's just business. Ain't not personal. Yeah. I still love you. I still respect you, but I got to get mine. Yeah. See, that's another thing, though. That's another thing. See, that's business. If you in a business and you don't know what the f*** going on, then you, you in the wrong business. That's any that, that's anything. You playing a game, you don't know how to play it, you're going to mm. lose. So, you know what I'm saying? It's always the better business man win. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So, and then with loyalty, I don't expect to be loyal. Right. You know what I'm saying? That ain't what I'm, that, I don't expect that because you, you expect to be loyal. That's when you set yourself up to get over. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So, if you don't expect it and you already <clears throat> looking for the, you know what I'm saying? Respect me, but I don't give a fuck what you do. Because mm. I expect you to not be loyal when you leave me. You see what I'm saying? No, nah, facts. So you respect me. As long as you respect me and you right here, it's all good. But nigga, I don't give a fuck what a nigga say behind that. You feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? Lawyer is, but then when a lawyer, it mean a lot, though. Because mm. it ain't a lot of lawyer. You know what I'm saying? Loyalty do mean a lot. But respect me, loyalty first, and then you can love me later. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I had somebody say uh, like, was, like was stronger than love. Damn, they said that? They said that, and they spit some too. They spit some behind it. It made you realize, like, damn, they know what they talking about. They basically saying, like, when you like somebody, you always want to be around them. Yeah. Think about the. Uh, you can love the, a love. I hate being around them. Huh? <laughs> think about that. Think about that. We both in a relationship. Think yeah. about the the honeymoon stage. Yeah. Just be likable, like, like we just like everything. Like each other. We going out all the time. Yeah. Love hurt. Though. Yeah, love hurt, boy. Ooh. Like, especially when you don't know how to do it yeah. properly, right? Yeah. You walk into something and it's like, man, I I just. I know how to love myself and shit. To be honest, I, might not know I barely love. even know how to love myself. You walk into it, you, you loving somebody, and it's like, you know the things you're supposed to do, but that's hard. Yeah. It's like, I'm supposed to be like, I'm supposed to do this, I'm supposed to do that, but yeah. I don't want to. Yeah. You f me over. Yeah. I want to walk away. Yeah. You disrespecting me. Yeah. You don't, you don't appreciate my work. Yeah. I want to walk away. Yeah. But when you love somebody, you got to fight. You can't walk away. <laughs> you like, oh. I got to goddamn do all this. I can't even leave this for <laughs> It hurt. Damn, I'm in love. That's when you realize you're in love. You're like, I'm in love, man. I want to say, Fuck I can't even say it because I'm I, in love. Oh my god, I got to deal with it. When you, <laughs> when you, when you, when you like somebody, yeah. How many times somebody disrespecting you when they like you? Like with, before the love part? Ain't it, it, it's barely. It's like it just. It's off, not no. It's not no. games. Yeah, it's not none. You need the password. My bad. That is amazing, bro. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Yeah. But uh, see, when you love somebody too, and they don't know how to love, if they they'll teach you how to love. Mm. You know what I'm saying? That's like kind of. What, I ain't know nothing about no real relationship. Shit, but if they with you like that, they like you enough Damn. and love you, and they see they see if you work with somebody, you gotta pay attention who you anyway. Mm. And if you really with them like that, you'll teach them how to love or how to you know what I'm saying. If never been in that kind of. Shit, if you with me enough, teach me because I don't know. Damn. And in what ways do you think your shorty taught you how to love? Taught me how to be respectful mm. toward females. You know what I'm saying? She taught me a lot of shit, man that come with real relationships. Me, I'm always, I always been a player. I ain't never cared about nothing. I'm doing this. I'm gonna do this, and I'll do what the fuck I want to do at any given moment. You know what I'm saying? But she just taught me how to goddamn how to how to just certain little shit, man. How to mm. respect. How to just shit I never thought of in a relationship. What was the hardest part for you? If you had to look back on it, shit, even now maybe. maybe. With the bitches. For real? Hell yeah, because I was just always f bitches. So it's like, but when I realized the value of not fucking with these bitches, and and all and, and it all being like in your household, it make your household more stronger. It make you even more stronger. Wait. Yeah. Hold up. Yeah. Let's talk about this. Come on. She had to stay through it, though. She had to stay through it? <clears throat> For her to love you through it, if yeah. that makes sense. No, nah, she she ain't had to love me through it because she had to, <clears throat> like, from the beginning, she gonna understand, she, you know what I'm saying, them girls smart. Mm -hmm. She understand who you is out the rip and what you doing and how you playing. You know what I'm saying? And she just little pointers, you know what I'm saying? And if you fucker accept them pointers and your pride don't get in the way of what you really, was really the uh, big picture, you'll be straight. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, just, you gotta wanna do better too, too, though. You know what I'm saying? You gotta wanna, it, it start with you too. You can listen to a fucker say whatever, but if you don't, if you don't wanna do it, you know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna, you ain't gonna do it. It's crazy, cause like I want, I've been playing all my life. With this. I want to not, I want to see what this shit like, and mm. I, I'm with it. That's hard. Yeah, it's it's, it's stabilized my mind. You know what I'm saying? 
it's it's as much as it's crazy because and I'm one of the biggest players. I was one of the biggest players for real. But it's, it's it, I ain't gonna lie. It's more gangster to be with one shorty though. Yeah, yeah. I realized that looking back on it, right at first we like man. I'm gonna play. I all leave it. I do what I like want. A, so you out here playing yourself, man? Yeah, playing but yourself it, in the end with all that. It's really more. It shows more about your character. Yeah, bossing up. Because a lot, I say this a, a couple times, and I can I'm, I stand on it. Mm. I feel like you show me a and over fucking off on his chick, mm. the one he stay with every day. Mm -hmm. Nigga look like damn, you doing folk like damn. That's Imagine just... how you gonna do me? Yeah, exactly. When the opportunity presents itself. Yeah, you got a chick you that love you. Yeah, y'all take care of each other. Y'all wake up every single day in the bed together. Yeah, and you got them leave and go play and come back. And you fucking over her and come back and play. You can't even lay in the bed. I I won't even feel right laying in the bed after I done played all day. Like, how you gonna come back and lay in the bed and act like it's cool? You mm. a you. A mm -mm -mm. <laughs> I think it's powerful. Like even just he hearing like somebody love you through that because we always try to put it on the same round, right? Mm -hmm. Like when I don't know, like I, just second conversation. Women say like men if if a man, if if a man cheat, women should leave him because if a woman cheat, men's gonna leave him. Mm -hmm. I feel like we all play our roles differently though. Exactly. Like disrespect, like I said, it's subjective. Mm -hmm. So a woman could be, they might not cheat on you, but they might disrespect you. Mm -hmm. Not saying this is your case. Mm -hmm. But I feel like if we love each other through it, we are able to see the best in each other. Mm -hmm. For sure. Bring the best. That's the, and that's the, that's what a relationship is, bringing the best out of each other, for real. Mm -hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Everybody got a, a chance to be the best person. You know what I'm saying? But it take that person to bring it out you. You know what I'm saying? You got to want to be the best person. You, you know what I'm saying? You got to, like, Dom, you know what the, you know what being being a better person is. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? You could be you, you look in that mirror. You know you can't lie to yourself. You know what mm. I'm saying? And if a person you got that that significant other, if they ain't bringing the best out you, what the f you with them for? That's mm. just a waste of time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's some real shit.